Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jess and in today's tutorial we are going to be learning a new stitch. The stitch we're going to learn is called a herringbone half double crochet. It's a super fun stitch. The half double crochet is definitely one of my favorite and the herringbone part of this stitch really adds a little bit of extra detail um, that really will take your project to the next level. So let's grab our supplies and we will get started. So for today's tutorial, I'm just going to be using this basic Red Heart yarn. It's nothing special, just a size 4 medium weight yarn. And to pair with that, I'm just going to be using my 3.75 millimeter crochet hook from Crochet Society. But you use whatever yarn or crochet hook that you're using for your pattern. Um, this is just what I've used for this tutorial. All right, so I have worked up a swatch here for us for this project. And I just wanted to show you, now it's, it's a very subtle stitch. Um, it's not going to be completely obvious, but if you look really closely, what the half double crochet, the herringbone version does, is it just gives a little bit of an angle to one of your rows and a tiny angle to the other row so that they're opposite. So this one's kind of going this way, this one's going this way, and so on and so forth to create that herringbone effect. It's really pretty. I'm creating a blanket with this right now and it is stunning. Uh, which is why I thought I would jump on here and show you guys how it works. So I'm just going to grab my hook here. Now for this stitch, a regular half double crochet is yarn over, pull and insert, pull through, you'll have three on your hook and you yarn over and pull through. Now the only difference to this stitch is we're going to yarn over we're going to insert into that hook that stitch there that first stitch yarn over and pull through so you have three but instead of yarn yarning over and pulling through right now what we're going to do is we're actually going to pull through that first loop so you only have two on your hook and then we're going to yarn over and pull through so we'll do that again yarn over, insert, yarn over, pull through, and we're going to pull through again that first stitch so you only have two, yarn over and pull through again, yarn over, insert, yarn over, pull through, pull through right away, yarn over and pull through, yarn over, insert, yarn over, pull through, pull through right away, yarn over, pull through two. It's a very subtle change to your stitch, but it does make all the difference. We'll do a couple more. Yarn over, insert into the next stitch, yarn over, pull through, pull through, yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, insert, yarn over, pull through that first one, yarn over, pull through those last two. Insert, yarn over, pull through, pull through, yarn over, pull through. Super, super easy stitch. Not much different from your regular half double crochet but it really does make all the difference. I'm having issues with this yarn right now. Yarn over, pull through, pull through, yarn over, pull through. I like the half double crochet because it has a perfect height, I think, for my liking. Spaces aren't too big, but not as small as the single crochet. Pull through, yarn over, pull through two. And we'll do one more. Insert, yarn over, pull through, pull through, yarn over, pull through. And that is how you complete the herringbone half double crochet. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. 
Let us know in the comments down below what project you're going to be using this stitch for. I can't wait to hear. Otherwise, we hope you guys have a lovely day and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.